So the video is going to be a two-parter. The first part is all about traveling from Surrey, England up to the Peak District. And we're going to just kind of see how the Tesla um, copes with that kind of level of distance. Um, how many times we need to supercharge, if at all. I'm hoping that I won't need to charge at all. I've got the granny charger, the three pin plug one um, in the boot. So hopefully we'll be able to charge at the Airbnb that um, I'm staying at over in the Peak District. Um, so if I turn around and kind of show you on a map where we're going from, let's turn UK round the right way. So we're in Surrey at the bottom, just below London. Um, and essentially we're going to be driving all the way up to there, which is near Sheffield um, So yeah, we'll see how we go currently. We're on 70% um, So I'm going to stick the home charger in and Try and charge it to a hundred percent So we'll charge it to 100% we're going to leave at about Five o'clock in the morning um, time now is nine o'clock um, and going off mountain biking so uh, I've packed the car up so in the front um, I've got uh, my helmet uh, rucksack uh, jacket I've got a power bank there um, I've got my EMTB um, charger um, and I've got two EMTB batteries 625 watts each actually tell her like that 625 watt that's 500 watt so uh, for the mountain bike so that's in there in the back with the bit seats folded down um, we've got snow foam we've got drinks um, seats are folded down uh, we've got jet wash um, and the EMTB is uh, sitting nicely in there uh, wheel on top as well so yeah, it's ready to go. So I'll see you in the morning or when we head off and we'll see how that we get on with power and consumption. Right, good morning everyone. <laughs> I'm just trying to wave the light to come on. Uh, right, I'll stand in front of the car. Uh, good morning everyone, it is 10 to five in the morning. Um, car is charged up to a hundred percent we're all not gonna go on our way all I need to do now is unplug the charger so so we got up to a hundred percent but because I conditioned the car um, and blasted the car with heat uh, we lost two percent um, as you can see it's completely pitch black outside um, so as we're driving um, it's going to have the Sun come up so let's pop the postcode in I think that's right so we're saying that we've got three hours, 37 minutes, 198 miles, so 200 miles odd that we're going to go. Now a really cool tip that you can do is if you tap on the graph, um, you can then tap on trip and it will tell you what percentage we should arrive with. So 30%, so we're going to do 200 miles, let's see whether or not we come back with 30%. Let's get on our way. of 
efficiency. So currently we've done 10 miles so far into the trip and we are at 217 watt hours per miles. Almost a quarter of the way there. We have 151 miles to go. with 30%, it then drops 20%, it then drops 17%. And I don't really fancy using a granny charge overnight on 17% uh, because it would just take too long. So what I've decided to do um, near Mansfield is go to a supercharger there. Um, and I should arrive with 29% on that supercharger. I will supercharge up to 90% uh, 141 miles, we're on 41%, um, it's 6 degrees outside and we are averaging 285 watt hours per mile. So Mansfield supercharger, we'll press the button, that opens that, in it goes. Uh, so, so far we have, da, 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 da. Right, let's change the charge to 90%. Uh, yeah, we're charging 150, up to 150. 59 yeah they're 256 kilowatt charging charging limits on 88% so let's just change that to so that's 90% so 40 minutes to get from 29% to 90% all good so we are now 88% don't know if you can see that we're three minutes from fully charging uh, we ended up um, towards the latter end on 39 kilowatts so it means that um, we will get to our destination with 75% so that's nice for the weekend um, and we got 36 miles left to go which I guess you can't see so yeah not a bad supercharge <laughs> We've arrived now in the Lake District. Uh, I think, I don't think it's gonna show us in trips. No, it's not. It's about 200 miles. We averaged about 280 uh, kilowatts. Um, yeah, two, 
to 80 watt hours per miles. Um, I'm on 76% after that supercharger. Um, but let me just show you the view, where, what we're looking at right now. Um, so here we are in the Lake District, surrounded by mountains, this huge lake here. Not the Lake District, Peak District. So all we gotta do now is get the mountain bike out. Um, as I said to you before, the mountain biking video will be on a different one. Um, but this one is all about the trip all the way up to the Lake District. So yeah, beautiful. But not Lake District, Peak District. Don't know why I keep saying that. Okay, so welcome back. I have I just arrived at the Airbnb. Um, I have plugged in um, an extension cord out the window. Three pins uh, plug going over here and extension cord in in the bin um, along with the um, uh, UMC charger and um, so that I could put it on charge. Um, and it's saying, I don't know if you can see that, it's saying about 11 hours, 10 minutes. So time now is, again, you can't see that. So time now is about 8.30. So should be good and fully charged to 90% by seven o'clock in the morning. All right, good morning, everyone. Day two in our cottage in uh, the Peak District. Charged up the um, Tesla. Charging when it's unlocked the charge port and boom, done. That's the end of our Peak District tour. So uh, temperature now is nine degrees. We got 78%. We're navigating home. It's about 200 miles from here. We've got 78% battery. It wants me to go to Northampton Supercharger, which is fine. That's good. So. Time now is 20 to 5. We are just turning off the M1 um, at 35% battery uh, to fill up at a supercharger. So we're at Milton Keynes, um, I think it's called Newport um, Supercharger. So uh, some statistics, we're at 35%. Um, we arrived here in a better than expected uh, battery performance. Um, if we look at the trips, 248 watt hours per mile, so that's really good, especially as the car was pre-heating um, for this. All right, let's go and fill up. We are filling up at 135 kilowatts. Leaving uh, the supercharger, uh, popped in. Um, put the charge up to 70% and we have got 77 miles to go. Uh, total cost of that supercharger from 35% to 70% was £11.10, so pretty decent. The reason why I took it up to 70% is because I've actually got quite a lot of other journeys, so I'm not just going home. Um, I've got, if I scroll to the bottom, um, I've actually got to go home, then I've got to go and drop my daughter in the middle of Sussex, then I've got to go and pick up uh, Tara, my partner, and then finally I'll get home, and I should get home with 31%. So, pretty decent. Uh, so, two to supercharges, total cost, I think it was something like £20 on the way up and £11 on the way back. So, £30 
did 400 miles getting there and back and then um, I think it was about 30 miles on each of the days so 460 miles in total my BMW X5 which I had before would do 550 at a cost of 120 pounds for a tank and that was at one pound 49 pence a litre so I'd imagine that for 30 quid that would have cost me somewhere around about a hundred pounds in in the um, in the X in the X5 so a third of the cost 